Good morning, guys. In the old Chesawiska, Florida swamp. Could be some yetis out here, some swamp creatures. There's plenty of mosquitoes out here. Kind of cool. It's about 160 degrees. A lot of skeeters flying, but see that little device? It's the only thing I'll keep you alive out here. Because they will suck your blood right out of you dry, let me tell you. Alright, I'm going to go down in the swamp, have a little sit down. I got my, got my little chair right here. Got the old Ruger 1022. Loaded up with some long rifles. It is deer season. I didn't bring a deer rifle. But, um... Uh, I don't know. I can kill a hog with this, this 22. So I can't I can't take a deer with it, but I can, I can take a hog with it. So we'll see. A lot of hogs, a lot of hog sign around in here. So we'll see what happens. Well, guys, no limb rats, no pigs. Oh, well, just a good place to come and uh, relax, listen to the woods, and lower your blood pressure. That's why we do this kind of stuff. Yep, pretty day, beautiful day. The swamp's dry. I can't believe it. Normally there's pockets of water all up in here. Yep. A lot of cabbage palm. Tons of cabbage palm. This is about the right size to eat too, by the way. That size right there. Here's another one. This one ain't bad. That's a good one there. I mean, there's thousands of them. But don't get caught chopping them out. Um, it's, it's illegal, but if you're hungry, who cares, right? Uh, you chop it off right about there, and then right about there. There's about three foot of core inside that thing. It tastes like cabbage. You boil it up with a little pork grease. Excellent eating. Excellent. Okay guys, that's it. Just a quick, quickie, quickie today. Beautiful day. Nice and cool. Actually, I got a little chilly. I had, a, had my uh, camo shirt on here and I had um, a camo hoodie over that. So I had to get rid of the hoodie. It was getting a little warm. And I've changed location. This place here, they've changed the entrance. The entrance used to be down further down by the gun range and they've changed it to a new deal here so it took me a little while to figure out my roads and stuff in here they redid some of the roads but this trail I'm on right now it goes down here it goes down in there another I don't know a thousand yards or more in the dead ends and I've seen pig down in there I've never taken a pig in here I bow hunted in here once. They won't let you shoot does. Trying to build those up. They won't let you shoot bobcats in here. This place ought to be just crawling with bobcats. It's funny, every every wildlife management area in Florida has got different rules. So when you come here to hunt, make sure you're on the right page. You can go to FWC. And um, <clears throat> which is Wildlife Management, Wildlife Commission, Florida Wildlife Commission. But they have, go to their section in there and Wildlife Management areas, you can pull it up. And you can see, I mean, there is tons of wildlife management areas in Florida. And most of them are free, go in for it free to get in. They do have you check in up here. There's a check-in station. So, um, 
Make sure you're on the right page because if you're not, these game wardens don't play games in Florida. And some of them <clears throat> used to have some nice guys, but I, anymore, these guys don't cut you any slack at all. And um, if you're farting under the covers, they're going to catch you, okay? Just be careful, guys. All right. I'll see you on the next one. I'm going to enjoy my little walk out of the swamp. See ya.